Moving on to business news, more franchise opportunities are now available for Gen Y entrepreneurs. This was made possible following a bigger allocation for financing aid provided by Prabadana National Berhad PNS for those interested to join the franchising sector. Farah Nabila Wazir has more. PNS has allocated financing aid of up to 70 million ringgit for the franchise industry in Malaysia this year, compared to only 50 million previously. The financial aid given by PNS covers 70 percent of the total project cost. Wherever kita bagi pinjaman ke orang, kita harapkan they make 10 times more than they borrow from us. The minimum is 5,000, the maximum is 2 million. But if it's 2 million is not enough, come and see me. <laughs> come on, if it's not enough, if you have a business and it's great and, and you, have the you have the motivation to do it, why can't we help you? Dato Sheikh was met during the International Franchise Summit 2015, which brings together local and international franchise founders under one platform to share and chart the future of the industry. The summit is also a step forward by PNS to strengthen its position as the lead agency in developing the franchise industry in Malaysia. The two-day event, which ends tomorrow, also aims to provide Gen Y franchisepreneurs the know-how to invest and start their business. Kita menggalakkan lebih banyak Gen Y untuk menceburi bidang franchise sebab franchise ni adalah saya boleh kata um, laluan yang paling mudah untuk seseorang mencapai uh, financial freedom maksudnya untuk mencapai kebebasan keuangan sebab daripada segi industri franchise lah kita belajar dua benda yang sangat penting iaitu kepimpinan dan juga sistem The event attended by some 400 participants from 8 countries includes 6 workshop where local and international academicians present their business research papers as well as a forum by international speakers. Farah Nabila Wazir for 7 edition.